Good morning and welcome to Heartland Makes. This morning we're going to be making this 3-in-1 dovetail workstation. And the reason it's 3-in-1, you've obviously got a spot to put the porter cable, dovetail jig, and then it's also got a drawer on this end. And then on the other end it's got a drawer that pulls out that essentially holds your router so that you've got a place to put your router when you're not actually cutting. You've got a good safe place to put it. You don't have to worry about your bit damaging your workbench or anything else. It's just a nice little router stand on the other end. So that's what this video is and let's go ahead and we'll get started. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I'm so dumb. I did this three times in a row. <laughs>
And that right there is why you always have a flashlight in your pocket. So that's what this video is going to be on today, is making this 3-in-1 workstation. We followed some plans that actually came in Wood Magazine's article, and this is, let's see here, the December-January 2021 magazine. So it actually came this month, and we followed his plans pretty much on all outside dimensions. The only thing that we did different is on the drawer where I put the stuff is I actually put 
little cubbies in there because the bits come in, they're on a little box. There's like four of them and they're numbered. So I've got those that I can put in here and that way they stay in the little protective case that they came in as well as they'll still have the numbers. The numbers will come important when you get ready to start making your dovetails is you've got a little chart on the side of the dovetail jig and it tells you what bit you need for depending on which side you're working on on the dovetails. And again, that's going to wrap up this video on making the three-in-one dovetail workstation. We appreciate you tuning in to Heartland Makes. We're going to be trying to provide a video at least every Thursday. We're going to try to do it every week. We will be moving sometime in the spring, so we may have a week or two where we're going to be down because we're going to be moving. I'm going to try to get some videos scheduled in advance so that there's not really an interruption in the, in the actual videos coming out. But again, we appreciate each and every one of you. And if there was something that you would like to see us make, feel free to contact us, leave a comment down below. I know we're going to have some videos coming out soon where we're actually going to be using this dovetail jig. So we've got some other things in mind as well besides building some cabinets that we've mentioned previously. So again, we appreciate your likes, comments, and subscribes, and may you have a blessed week. So that's what the video is and let's get to making.